Hello, Tisha Ann. Hello, Sarah. Okay, good uh, uh, good morning, Sarah girl. Sarah, good morning. Good morning. Okay, oh, Sarah, I forgot. Okay, so supposed to be right today is our regular class, right? Regular class, Saturday, 9 a.m. So, yeah. so we don't have, we still have two makeup classes to do. So, uh, uh, how about tomorrow, Sarah, <coughs> 9, uh, 9 a.m. again? Would that be okay? Uh, can we didn't learn the, can we didn't learn um, the class of, um, wait me a minute. Okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, you think first what you will say. Uh, yeah, Sarah. Can we did learn in the class of the uh, yesterday? Ah, okay, yesterday. okay. Yeah. Yesterday. So we will not make make two makeup class. It's okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. No problem. So I will see you. Okay, wait. So I will see you. Okay, today and Tuesday and Thursday. Okay. Tuesday oh. evening, 7 p.m. Are you free? At what day? 7 p.m. Tuesday. Tuesday, 7 p.m. Yeah. Okay. Tuesday, 7 p.m. Okay. I will see you on Thursday again, 7 p.m. Okay. 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 I will just, I will just message you in the Zalo. Okay, Sarah? Okay, so let us yeah. start now. Okay, so first, Sarah, we're going to do the speaking first. Okay, wait me a minute. Okay, let us do the speaking first. I will ask question, and then after that, we're going to do the reading. Where is it, Sarah? I will share it to you now. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so let us have this. It's okay, English tests for speaking. So here's Sarah, teacher, and like to ask some question for you. Okay, first, Sarah, do you like reading books, Sarah? Yeah. Okay, now, what sort of books do you like? What sort of books do you like? It's storybook. Okay, so do you often read books in your free time? Yeah. Oh, uh, so I guess you love fairy tales and story books, short story books. You love that? Yeah. Okay, that's great. Okay, so next, Sarah, is where do you often buy books? In Usually, the bookshop. In the bookshop. Oh, wait, Miss Sarah. Okay. 
Okay. Have you ever read an e-book? Computer book? Yeah. Okay, mostly you do that. Okay. So, okay. Ah, I guess we're done with this. If you remember, we I already asked you about this. You remember, Sarah? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, okay. So, let us move now to reading. Okay, reading 2.3. Okay. So, here we have only four short vocabulary words. We have the word fridge. Okay. Oasis. <coughs> guidebook. And climb. Okay. So, you know this. Okay. The ref, the fridge or refrigerator. The oasis, this one. And of course, the guide book. Okay, you have this one. You have the guide book. So here's Sarah, please check and answer.
I'm planning teacher Anne. Teacher Anne. I'm finished. Okay, so we have here with Sarah. Okay, so there are cheaper, these are cheaper if you buy several of them. So it means if you buy many, it becomes cheaper. Okay, so what is that? Okay, answer. It is, oh, letter. The answer, letter E. Oh, let me see. Number one is E. All this week, buy five, get one free. So it means, Sarah, if you will buy, buy many, you can have less price. Okay. Wait me a minute, Sarah. I will just charge the laptop. <laughs> Okay. Okay, Sarah. So here it means that if you will buy or if you will buy many, you can you can buy or you can have less price. Okay. So two, you can get many different meals here. Letter C. Soup and hot pies only. So it means you can't. So it means there are less meals that they offer in the restaurant. Only soup and hot pies. Okay, next number three. Put this in a cold place. Put this in a cold place. Okay, it is letter A. Keep in fridge keep in fridge okay next you are too late to get a set for this show okay it is what it is okay three number four is g very good all tickets are already sold so it means you cannot buy tickets anymore Okay, too late for you. Five, this place is not open all night. So your answer is letter B. Very good, Sarah. Door locked at midnight. Okay, so this place is not open all night. So during nighttime, it is closed. Oh, you've got one mistake, Sarah. See, very good. You're improving a lot, Sarah. Great job. Okay, so here, this is quite easy, Sarah. Please take note. Okay. Please answer, Sarah. <laughs> what happened to you, Sarah? Do you have cough? Yeah. Oh, the same with teacher. Teacher Anne also has a cough because uh, I drink... Uh, Cold water.
I'm finished, Jean. Okay, so number six. Okay, let's get a video. And watch. Oh, very good. <laughs> and watch it at my house this evening. So mostly video can be watched, right? Okay, yeah. like video. That's blank. What is that? Okay. That's great Ah, uh, that's great idea, Jane. Uh, they went to the video stop and choose. Okay, choose is present tense, Sarah. The past tense of choose is still choose, but the past participle is chosen. Okay, remember that. Then they bought some what? Hands of color. Okay. They took everything back to Lisa's house and enjoyed the film together. Oh, very good. Oh, wow. Very easy, right? Okay, so yeah. this one. I know it's very easy for you. Okay, this one. Please answer. Ah, Sarah, wait me. I will just go to the bathroom. I need to pee for a while. Okay, just answer. Please wait, teacher, okay? Sarah, I need to pee first, okay? Just answer.
I'm finished. Okay, Sarah. Okay, let us walk to the park. What is your response? All right. All right. Uh, when did you arrive, Sarah? When? Tomorrow. Tomorrow, teacher. Oh, yesterday because when? When? It means it already happened. Okay, you understand? Yeah. When? Okay. Okay, 13. Shall I open the window? Yes, please. Yes, please. Oh, I got a letter from Paul this morning. <laughs> That's nice. That's nice. How's your sister? She's very well. She's very well. Oh, very good. Yay, great job. Okay. So, very easy. Again, easy teacher Anne. Okay. Complete the conversation. What does the tourist say to shop assistant? So, there is the tourist who go to the shop and ask assistant from the shop assistant. Okay. So, please check it out, Sarah.
I'm finished to your arm. Did you arm? Okay, I'm here. Okay, so we have here, so it talks here about the tourists asking information on the shop assistant, okay? So here, I am the assistant, Sarah, and you are the tourist. So for example, you are asking assistance from me because I am the shop assistant, okay? Let us check your answer first. Letter B, correct. F correct, H correct, A and letter E. Okay. So for children or adults, okay, let us, I am the assistant, Sarah, and please read the chorus. Okay, your answer are all correct. Very good. Okay. For children or adults, <coughs> Sarah, sorry, oh, Sarah. Oh, it's for me. I was a real cook. Oh, a lot of <coughs> tourists buy this one. That's very heavy. Have you got a smaller one? Oh, what about this one with fewer pages? That Sarah. looks better. How much is it? Oh, that hard back is eight pounds and the paper back is 3.50 pounds. Bye. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I take the cheaper one. Oh, fine. Shall I put it in a bag for you? No, thank you. I want to use it now. Ah, uh, here you are. Thank you. Goodbye. Thanks. Uh, goodbye. Okay, so they are talking. So the the tourists buy the <coughs> which one? The hard back or the soft back? The paper back. Uh, what? Which one? Does the paperback is because what about this one with fewer pages? Okay, so he said that looks better. How much is it? Okay, so what do you think the tourists bought in the shop store? In the shop, in the bookshop. Do you think he wants to buy a what? A book. He wants to buy a book. And he is choosing whether the hardback, the thick, or the paperback. So paperback, of course, it is quite cheaper when we compare to the hardback. Okay. So this one, this is the hardback, quite thick. And this is the paperback. Okay. Oh, yeah, that one. So, this is quite uh, expensive compared to the paperback. Okay, so here, you read the article about a young woman. Okay, and please answer the question afterwards. This is about Rebecca Stevens. Okay.
Okay? Yes. Okay, one minute more. C. Oh, it's B. 